Once upon a time, we cared about the welfare of our fellow Americans. Farmers in the Midwest devastated by tornadoes, trailer parks washed away in Florida hurricane. Our country is raking on various international comparisons. We all rooted for our fellow Americans. Like all countries, we would squabble, but we were family. We were all Americans. Businessmen, Wall Street bankers, ethnic activists, Democrats, Republicans. All of them have a stronger fellow feeling toward Saudi princes and German bankers than toward Iowa farmers. Being inclusive to dreamers necessarily means being exclusionary toward our own working class. Members of our governing class seem to have decided the country is doomed, so they may as well make their pile. Sure, they'll have to face the wrath of voters and may be voted out, but they'll end up on corporate boards or win lucrative lobbying contracts. Plus, being progressive on immigration will look great on their kids' uh, application. A 1995 home article in the New York Times uh, Times claimly described preparations for the Immigration and Neutralization Service was making in a case of a vast flood of illegal immigrants circled across the Mexican border. Very recently, a presidential candidate who seemed uh, to actually care about America's working class denounced legal immigration as a Koch brothers idea. That was Barney Sanders. Open borders? No, said Barney. No, that's a Koch brothers proposal. That's a right-wing proposal which says essentially there is no United States. It would make everybody in America poorer. You're doing away with the concept of a nation state. You have an obligation, in my view, to do everything we can to help poor people. Have well-heeled Americans really decided to abandon their fellow citizens? These merchants of comparison have none to spare for our own people. I'm not a steel worker, a waitress or a block teenager looking for an entry-level job either, but I still care about other Americans. Thanks for watching this video guys. All rights are reserved to the author of this, which is Anne Coulter, and we kindly thank her for cooperating with the media. Also, I'd like you to subscribe my channel for more news videos daily and for more news and viral things, of course.